Hello and welcome back to Fallout 4. Last time we made it all the way back to Concord and then didn't go to Concord and instead went to a gas station where we happened to find Miz your dog here. Hello dog, how are you? We also f found a terrible cavern underneath the um, said, what is it called, a gas station? Right, gas station. I'm having trouble remembering gas station dog, please remember it for me, thank you very much, very good. Uh, we killed some mole rats. There was an irradiated mole rat down there. It was terrible. And we're gonna have to go down here and see what we can do. Oh my lord, fusion core. Thank you. Um, what else we got? Trash Busters Award. On behalf of the Boston Regional Office, I would like to congratulate you and your team on winning 2076's Trash Busters Award for the greatest year-to-year -year waste reduction by a single store. Respect for the environment is an integral part of our corporate image, and we appreciate your innovative efforts. Well, I don't think they were very innovative, actually. They just, like, put it underneath them. Pipe pistol, 10 millimeter round. Oh, they have, like, individual rounds? My goodness, that's clever. We are being slowly irradiated, dog. Dog! Dog, did you stay over there so you wouldn't get irradiated? You're not following me, dog. Hey, dog. Let's go. Follow me, dog. How do we, uh... There we go. Okay, come on, dog. Well, we have managed to kill everything in here, apparently. Back up to the surface, dog. We've cleared out our new home. That's right, dog. Our new home. We're gonna go and become a great ruler of nations in this gas station. It'll be amazing. Okay, dog. Come on. Time to see if we can renovate this place quite nicely. Let's see what we can do. Let's, ah, get out of my way. Okay. Okay, dog. Let's first survey the situation. Dog? Do okay. S screw you, dog. That's fine. Okay. What I'm thinking is we get like some of the- oh, hi dog. Thanks. We get some of this junk out of here. We got like cars all junked up and jazz. You need to put walls around like this bottom area and we need to get like some sort of stairway up to the top. And we'll have lookout guards on the top and we'll of course leave the rocket because you don't want to get rid of the rocket. Rocket's way too cool. Rocket is the best. So let's see what we can do. Um, I believe... Although I haven't done it before, that this is where we do things? Ah, yes it is. The workshop allows you to build, adjust, and remove nearby objects or structures. Move between options with arrow keys and up to find the build, the object or structure you wish to build. If you select ob if your selected object appears green, press E to build it. If it appears red, try adjusting your location till it changes to green. Oh, amazing! Well, guys, give me like seven and a half hours and I'll be right back with an awesome fortress. Oh my lord, okay, so we built some stuff. It's great, isn't it? So much fun building so many things. Dog, hello dog. So we built, I built a little stairway to the roof up and into here. Look, we can get up right underneath the rocket. It's amazing, it's great. It's great. We've cleaned up the place quite a bit. It was terrible. Oh my lord, that is so off. I didn't even realize. Anyway, um, down below we put walls around the bottom area. I'll work on it more between episodes. Thank you very much. It does actually take quite a while to do this, but I quite enjoyed it quite a bit. It was fun. So we can go in through here. When the bandits do attack, we can sit in here, crouch down, and just lob bullets over them. It'll be amazing! We do need to get people in here, though. Not really sure about how to do that one. But, in the very least, I mean we have a little fortification here. And in the future, it shall be built up to be the greatest fortification in the world. Dog, in the world. Okay. Now that we've done that, we need to examine where to go next. Let's look at the map. Where's the map? There we go. Okay. So we've gone out this way quite a bit. I'm thinking we should stick around the red rocket truck stop, just for now. And maybe go out around this direction and see what we can find. We're going to, um, 
Ooh, what the heck is that? New. How about we... I don't know how to... Fast travel to selected no location. No place marker. Can I get rid of my marker? Ah, there we go. Remove marker. There we go. Nice. So, we're going to go out in this general direction. Let's just place a marker over there. And we'll head out there. This way, dog! Let's go see what adventures we can have in this direction. We've already built, like, a like gas station paradise or something. It's amazing. And now we're going to go out here and, like, kill some, like, raiders and stuff. It'll be amazing. It'll be brilliant. That's a stump of some sort. Got ourselves a water tower here. Given that it is in close proximity to my fortification, we do need to figure out what the heck's going on here. Mmm, Stimpak purified water. Not much, I have to say. Maybe if we get- oh, good lord. Wait, we're gonna crouch for this. Dead in one shot. So good. Dog meat. Shh. Bloatflies are the worst. Dog meat, if the bloatflies find us, we're gonna be in a bad situation. Ooh, what do we got here? Some neighbors. Oh, wow, they seem to have quite a nice little- oh, random shots. Didn't mean to do that, I twitched, okay? Good lord, I'm not shooting at you people. Seem to have a nice little fortification here. Hmm. Don't see anyone. Dog, do you see anyone? Let's, uh, see what we can do. Um, that's a stump. Looks like there's been some... Some cutting down trees around here. Oh. What do we have here? Chem station? That's never a good sign. Let's see what we can see. Shh. Oh, look. Look. It's a man. And is that a young boy or a woman? Looks like a young boy. No, actually... He's got the chest bulb. Bulge. <laughs> I think it's a woman. Come on, dog. Let's, uh... Hello? Look, there's a cat. Dog? 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 Dang it, dog. Where'd you go? Oh, good lord. Anyway. We're gonna take a leap of faith, dog. There you are. Come on. We're gonna take a leap of faith and, uh, see who these people are. Hello, are you going to shoot us? No? Wow! That's new. Come on, dog, let's go talk to these people. Who are you? Blake Abernathy of Abernathy Farm. That's close enough, stranger. We're a peaceful farm. We don't want any trouble. Well, I know, I don't, I don't want any trouble either. I'm friendly, it's mate. Okay. I'm friendly. Not looking to cause any trouble. If you say so, but be warned, we're armed here. So don't try anything. Let me Dude, I would you. pop you in the head so quickly. Easy. Out in the field all day, every day, and every minute of it spent watching your back. Oh, that's not good. Uh, what do you grow out here, people? Growing. Mostly potatoes so far. Ah, oh, you're starting melons. You new to the that's amazing. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm kind of, that's, oh, uh, well, no, the truth is I'm sort of yes. new to the Commonwealth. And no, it's a long story. Either way. Very it's strange one. Face. How about you? Ever think about working the land? Uh, maybe at some point, I don't know. I mean, I got a little fortification over there. I'm some, sure someone's going to have to eat at some Never point. really thought about it. Hell, neither did I. I was born into it. Oh, Where nice. If you do start up a farm... Be ready to deal with the raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? I know, seriously? Um, I <laughs> hate raiders. I do hate raiders so much! They're so terrible! My daughter Mary tried to stand up to him. Oh, that probably didn't end up... No, yeah, I kind of thought something like that happened. You probably need someone like me around who's absolutely insane. <laughs> <laughs> she deserved it. Oh my goodness. That's terrible. There's nothing worse than losing a child. Believe me, I know. I'm sorry to hear you say Slightly that. acquainted. I, I kind of forgot that my son was dead, but, Those you know. Oh no, he's alive. It's alive my wife too. that's dead. It's, been in it's probably not a good thing to forget about. Anyway. Get it back? 
How are you doing? Wait, what'd you say? Where are they? Do you know where they're coming from? Yeah, pretty sure I do. One of them mentioned Olivia while they were here. My guess is they're holed up in that old USAF station. Um, USAF station? As in the one I, like, absolutely wrecked? Do I have her locket? I don't, do I? No. Um. New here? Well, if you've got anything worth trading, you can talk to me. Oh, huh, nice. Uh, what do you got for sale? It ain't a lot, but I've got a few basic supplies. Ammo, meds, that sort of thing. Nice. I would be very interested in your ammo. Sounds good. What do you got? 10.308 rounds. Ugh, oh, you make me want to die. It's so bad. Patched three-piece suit. Oh, not even worth it. Get out of my face. How do I exit? Tab. Good lord. Da not interested. So. Great. Maybe next time you can get right to the point instead of wasting my time. Hey, shut your mouth, Connie. Dog, sick him. Well, Come on, Connie. dog. I'm gonna get the friggin' locket. Hey, Brahmin, you're disgusting. Good lord. Dog. 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 Hey, dog. <clears throat> you got some trouble, don't you, dog? You're not really good at finding your way around. Well, we need to go back to the USAF station to go get that locket. Which is wretched. We're gonna do... Now we're gonna place a marker and we're gonna walk. We're gonna be good people and walk it. No fast traveling, Jazz. We only get to fast travel when we're so high level that anything on the road is just a minor inconvenience. Until then, bloat flies need to be killed along the way. And who better to kill said bo bloat flies than myself? Come on, dog. What are you even thinking? Ah, uh, look, dog, it's our fortification. How nice. How diddly nice. Uh oh. Woo! Okay. Whoo, we're gonna need to run a bit of the way, aren't we, dog? Come on, dog, let's go. Hi, dead mole rats. I'm sure you'll despawn eventually, and when you do, I will be so happy. You don't even know. What do we got up here? Hmm. I doubt there's going to be much in our way. That should mean that we actually get to our destination really quickly. Because, I mean, it's not that far away. I mean, we walked half the distance pretty much already. We can go back to the USAF station, find the stinking locket, which I'm sure is just sitting in plain sight. And I looked at it, and I was like, Psh, I don't want that jazz. And that's a nice little silver piece of jazz. Nobody wants that kind of jazz. Ow! Ow! I thought that was a bear for a second. Oh, my lord! Okay, let's take a second. I don't even know I'm not hitting these morass. Would you die? Dog! Dog, where are you? Dog? Dog's abandoned me out here, hasn't he? Oh, that, that one's dead. Dog, are you over here? Ah, oh, dog, you killed one of them. Okay. You're not the worst, dog. I'm still not happy with you. You should have been there right by my side, eating all the ones that were trying to nibble on my friggin' legs. But, dog, I guess that's not the worst. It's acceptable that you at least tried. Yeah, we've been through here, killed everything. Oh, yeah, we dropped our stuff over there. That's right. Dog, we leave a trail of random jazz behind us wherever we go. It's amazing. Oh, my lord. Bunch of dead rats over there. You see something, dog? What do you got, dog? Oh, just some glowing fungus? Dog, that is so useless. Dog, please only alert me to things that are actually useful. My goodness, dog, you're such a fool. Getting me an adjustable wrench, and now you're trying to get me some glowing fungus? What are you on about? What do we got here? Is this a downed helivac thing? Oh, is that a rags radstag over there? Dog, can you hunt rad stags for me? Not that I really want them, but I mean, if you could, that'd be nice. Got some rad away. We got not much else. Just some rad away. There's some sort of terrible military robot chilling out in here. Ah, it just kind of looks like a. Hey! 
Hey! What do you mean danger? Dog? What is it? Dog, tell me what it is. Is it a Yaogwai? Oh, is it that rad stag? Rad stag, I don't care about you. I don't want to hurt you. Get out of here. Let's see. Anything in this helivac? Not really. Except for... Dog, are you hunting... Oh, okay, fine. There's a suit of power armor just chilling out here. What the heck? Nice. There's a dead dude next to it, too. Bonus. Well, hello, power armor. You're now mine. Are you kidding? Okay. We got our fusion core from the other place. We will uh, chill in this power armor. And we can bring it back to our nice little fortification. We'll have a suit of power armor with us after we, of course... You know, do our little job out here. Dog, how did I miss this the first time? I can't even believe it. Such a good thing we were told to come back here. And dog, would you stop hunting the rad stags? My goodness, I don't even think they give us anything good. Probably like a rad stag head. Which quite frankly, would actually kind of be cool. Although I guess they'd technically give us two rad stag heads, but, you know, those are technicalities there. Okay, in we go. Oh, yeah, I really do remember this place, don't I? Oh, it was so terrible. Okay, there's nothing we want. Into the satellite station! Good luck, people! Okay, we are inside. Dog? Dog, this is a place from long before you came with us. And by long before, I mean actually not very long before. It was moments before you joined us that we uh, came down here and learned all the great things. Oh, we didn't even use the intel room key. Oh, we're the worst. My goodness. It's a good thing we came back here because we missed so much stuff. There we go, 10 millimeter rounds, compensated, hairpin, 10 millimeter... What? That's so awesome. That had so many adjectives on it, I had to take it. It's not even a question. Got some dish rags, cigarettes, we got desk, dead dude, nuke cola, mini nuke, gotta take the mini nuke. What's that? U.S. Covert Operations Manual. Permanently more difficult to detect while sneaking. Nice. Dog, we just became so much more sneaky. We got some Nuka-Cola, too. Ooh, look at all this ammo. Oh, my lord. Why are there pipe rifles in here? You'd think they'd have actual guns instead of disgusting pipe rifles. My lord, I've barely even seen any actual guns. It's just like my combat shotgun and the submachine gun, which no longer exists. Ooh, handcuffs. Nice. Those two are really the only things we have. My word. There's some folder here. Well, that was pretty nice. Dog, that was some good stuff. Good thing we came back here, dog. Now, let's see. Where in the world is our objective? Hmm. It's a locket. So I doubt it's in the restroom. It's very unlikely. Do, however, find it quite necessary for you to wash your hands. Thank you very much. Wash them, you fool! There we go. The hands are washed, dog. What else do we got? Mm, liquor bottle. I'm not seeing. Ooh, a Medex. Not a stim pack. Medex. But no locket here. Dog, if you see the locket, please inform me, because it's kind of really important that we find the locket. Let's see. Not in this. So this was the minigun dude, Ak Ak. So he didn't have the locket, or she, I can't even remember. Let's see, desk. Where in the world is the locket? Dog. Dog, help me here, dog. Use your snout to find me the locket. Not that the locket actually really smells like anything, I would imagine. 
I'm guessing it really doesn't. Ooh, military grade circuit board. Nice. Terminal? Have we used this terminal before? Satellite dish status offline. We got a system error. That would make sense. It's kind of broken. Data stream status offline with a system error. And database network offline. Database access is granted to authorized personnel only. Oh, so perhaps if we became authorized personnel, we could possibly, uh, you know, get in there and see what's going on with the database. That could be interesting, dog, but on the other hand, it could be very boring. So I don't even know. We got a plunger, some turpentine. Lots of stuff here. We got some rad roaches. Anything, dog. Anything regarding this uh, locket at all. Combing the entire area. Dog, this is one elusive locket. Not to say that most lockets aren't elusive. They actually tend to be quite elusive. Because they're tiny little things. Absolutely wretchedly small. There's gonna be one here somewhere, I swear. Got it. There it is, dog. Found it. Very nice. Okay. Away we go and back over to the farmhouse. My word. What an eventful everything, dog. What an eventful. Let's go bring this locket back and make them like us. Because they don't seem to be particularly interested in me at the, this moment. Because, I mean, they're terrible people. They're the worst people in the world. I can't imagine any people better than them. Except for maybe, like... I don't know, like, not Tom Cruise. Only not Tom Cruise because he's a Scientologist, or I think he's a former Scientologist at this point. I don't really see a difference between current Scientologists and former Scientologists. So really, they all look the same to me. Yeah, I'm kind of terrible in that way. Scientology, not acceptable. What the heck was that? Was that a radio thing? Well, come on, dog. The ghosts in the radio have spoken to us and they've said weird things, so we're gonna go back to the farm and with any hope maybe not die a terrible death, maybe. Mm -hmm. Going to uh, place a marker. Oh! Hey, wait! Wait, what are you? What are, what are you doing here? What? You can't just do that! I know you have laser guns and stuff, so I'm not actually gonna shoot you, but you can't just fly around and just... The gall of that little robot. My goodness. Anyway, we got bigger fish to fry than some robot running around in the waste, which I'm sure is actually quite important, but on the other hand, I'm going to head over here in the hopes that maybe... We're almost at the farm. That's the farm right there. Completely uneventful walk over here. Nothing happened at all outside of the little robot dude. Who I barely consider to be a thing to begin with. So, gun away. We're gonna go in and have a small chat with the people. Hello, Brahmin. Brahmin. Hey, guess what? You're not all dead. That's nice. Hey, dude. I got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. I'm sure she'll go lean on the prices after what's done. And feel free to use our workshop. Please do. Thank you, Mr. Blake Abernack. Abernack. Abernathy. Sorry, I got your name wrong. Thank you, Mr. Blake Abernathy. Yeah, I'm now allowed to use his workshop. How nice. I don't really want to, though. I mean, we've already got a nice fortification over there, and we don't want to move over to here. But I appreciate the offer anyway. Well, very nice. Dog, don't get in the fire and kill yourself, please. That brings us to the end of the episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, like and subscribe. Next time, there should probably be some changes to the... Our fortification we have out there, over there. 
or work on building it up quite a bit more. It might look completely different when we get back. Anyway, where's Dog? Dog, thank you for journeying with us, people. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, like and subscribe. And until next time, thank for, thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>